Uh, how do you see the role of renewable energy sources evolving in the future? And how does your education prepare you for this shift? Yeah, so there are a few courses that uh, give me a good opportunity to design a solar panel or design a solar system for a commercial or residential based solar, what we say. So even a home I can design, I have the, that's that was a core course for me, which helped me a lot, giving, getting internships, getting interview calls when I when I used to apply to them. Uh, other than that, even in wind, we had a very good professor who was who was working with a in a in a very great uh, company named General Electric, which is a big a big company in US. So he has they have uh, kind of helped us going through. And if you want to go in any of the domain, they'll help you get connections, mostly through LinkedIn or through word of mouth, which helped a lot, which helped a lot for my batchmates and me to get an internship in the summer or even jobs. So talking to alumni, I know they are having well-paid jobs that a data analyst or a CS guy gets. Mm -hmm. So I know the market is still booming while in recession because we have seen getting people graduate and still getting jobs in our sector. Yeah. Well, that's great. So the university, how, how much the you know, for career opportunities do you see for energy engineering graduates and how are they different in India and in US? Uh, so in the US, uh, <clears throat> I see mostly solar engineers, PV design engineers that design systems for companies and even consultant consultancy and sales. If you are good in sales, you can go towards that in solar energy. It, it's a very high paying job. It gives incentives. But mostly when you are an engineer, you want to design stuff. So being a design engineer is the very good. Mostly what they take and consulting companies and clients that how much or what you want to do with your so when when a company comes that we want solar so consulting them that how you can go towards it what's your budget knowing all that if if you don't want to go into solar it, there are companies like manufacturers and wind manufacturers turbines that also do the design if you want to go into the research sector or design sector where you will design the wind turbine or design the solar uh, panel or the system for your company and the company will do the rest of the things. So other than that in India, I have uh, not been so keen, but in fuel cells or this, they will do the testing of solar panels. I don't see any more designers. They'll just teach them because there is, there are very few courses for solar design, solar or wind or renewable energy in India with good colleges there. So that's the only difference I see. But now I have got to know that there are companies that need solar because India is also going towards renewable energy as as soon as possible. And then maybe there will be a need for those in India too. So if you don't want to stay here, you can grab an education and go back to India to earn that much. Okay, so what kind of impact do you hope to make in this field once you graduate? Uh, mostly I would like to go to a like when hearing about these things is you change the world, but uh, making it break even because we are making also solar panels and I've known companies using solar panels to make solar panels, very old companies which have the capital to do that. So going into one of those companies would be far better so that I'm putting a very big, big impact rather than just making solar panels to power a house or power a commercial building rather than doing it a full cycle of doing it renewably and uh, another domain that i wanted to go is in green hydrogen which is a very booming uh, in, uh, sector nowadays because using solar panels to make hydrogen because hydrogen is much better and always available because of water so sometimes solar panels deteriorate but hydrogen fuel cells don't so there are much of advantages so that would be a bigger impact i guess yeah. I recently also heard that there were there was a uh, air water created. Yeah. Yes. So a lot of things are you know. Yeah. Shifting a lot. So you yes. Don't know where it will go. Yeah. Okay. So um, 